And look at me. I feel lonely at times as well, you know. I said that right. I feel lonely at times as well. If you've been watching me for some time, <laughs> you know I'm very big about being secure in yourself, your purpose, improving the mindset. But you know it's completely fine to feel alone. If that's your self-improvement journey, if that's you're just doing something completely different to any, everyone else, right? You know, this idea of fitting in doesn't technically even exist anymore. It comes from caveman ages. You know that. Where if you got kicked out, or if you weren't accepted in the group or the family, you were more likely to die. It's normal to feel like you want to fit in. It's normal to feel like you don't want to be alone. Look at me. It is so normal to feel like you want to be wanted, to be a part of the group. But again, you know what I'm going to say, to what extent? So let me paint the picture for you. As you can see, my lovely bed. They've got the new covers because it's winter. So I'm sleeping or getting ready to sleep. It's cold. You know, they say like, what is it? Snuggle bunny. Bunny? Snuggle, <laughs> vintage as fuck. Snuggle buddy for like winter, right? Because it's cold. Oh, wish, could, wish someone could be there. And you know, when I was going to sleep, I was just like, oh, yeah. I wish there was like a, a girl here or something that could like spoon or hold, you know, at night. I don't know. It just that thought just came into my mind. But, but this is where I'm gonna go and attack you now. <laughs> well, I have to. That's the big difference between me and you. Me in that scenario, what did I do? As you saw, the doors opening. Mum came in, authentic as fuck. Could keep going. Doors open, lights come down, whatever. So, what is the big difference? What did I do that? you probably what did i didn't do that you probably would have done because you know i have to attack you so me there oh i feel a bit lonely that was the, that was me painting the picture oh, i wish there was someone here i know you can see some toys on my bed to relax so yeah well i'm, well, I'm 24 and i sleep with toys go laugh at me I've, I've sleep with toys and i'm 24 years of age go laugh at me prick <laughs> messing so me in that scenario i was like oh you know whatever but I was just like, cool, again, don't immerse in the emotion, as I said, view it from a third person. I, I feel a bit lonely here, maybe because it's cold, maybe because, you know, I haven't had sex with a girl for like a month or something. Maybe something, maybe lacking intimacy, hormones, whatever. I observe it and I'm like, okay, cool. What can I do in this scenario? Can I, can I, am I, am I a Tian Wei to call a girl up right now? No girls come into my yard at this time in my family here. It's not going to happen, all right? So, <laughs> toys it is. <laughs> time to hug them. So, I'm just like, no problem. I, I understand that I, I view the emotion and I don't immerse in it and don't feel lonely to affect my day later. So, what did I do? I went to sleep and I woke up and I've been having an amazing day so far and it's going to be an amazing day to continue, right? But I didn't wake up feeling, oh, I feel lonely. Oh, I haven't been with that girl. I haven't seen someone. I haven't done that. Like... I just view it, and this is what you would have done. And don't lie to me. <laughs> Come closer, you can be honest with me, innit? What have you done? Midnight, oh. Hey, are you up? Hi. Because I'm FaceTiming someone, innit? Of course, someone. Hi. Hi, um, Maritza. I know we haven't spoken for months, but you're just on my mind. Uh, Shut up, you. She wasn't on your mind because you're vulnerable, innit? That's why. You don't care about Maritza. <laughs> you just wanted someone there. And that's completely fine. I'm not slandering you for it. I'm just saying that emotion, I viewed it and didn't immerse in it. But the vast majority, and maybe you can relate, you, you would immerse in it. Or you would spend that extra hour chatting to someone. Or maybe two, three hours trying to message someone. And then you're going to wake up a bit later. And then you won't have the most productive day. And you'll lack momentum. And then maybe your sleep cycle is ruined. And then can you see how it can affect you? I experience these things. There's so many things I don't want to do every day, just working out. Even before I kind of started filming, I didn't really want to film, you know, because I'm very hungry right now. <laughs> Mum opening the door, these sort of things. My parents are in the house. So you just have to get it done and you just have to view it and not immerse with it and understand that I feel lonely. That's completely fine. I feel anxious. That's completely fine. I feel sad in this moment. That's completely fine. 
Kiri feels lonely at times. Kiri spoke about his hardships. Look how I admire to be like this girl. He's done something right or he has something that maybe I aspire to get one day. That's where you just view it from the third person perspective and say, yeah, it's completely fine to feel like this. I'm not a bad person for feeling like this. It's just myself, it's just an emotion and I just experience it and that's completely fine. You can't control your emotions and how certain things make you feel, but you must, must, must understand this key point. The only thing you can control is how you react. There's a click now. You can't control the emotions and what happens to you, but you can control how you react. Myself, I feel a bit lonely. I'm just gonna go to sleep whatever the majority of other people hey you up are you here oh you want to meet now and then it fix it spirals this is how it goes okay and you must understand that key point if you want to fix your life today or have access to my free self-improvement guide all links will be down below